Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. So as you can clearly see, I have another haul for you guys today. Not my photo card collection as promised, but let's be real, when do I ever keep my promises? So anyways, today I have eight K-pop related packages, so all the ones that you see in the back. And then I also have 13 trades, so these two piles over here. And then I also have three manga related packages, so these two from Amazon and this bag from Barnes & Noble. So yeah, I'm going to save the manga stuff though till the end of the video because I know not everyone is into manga, but I do have a lot of fellow weebs who watch my videos, so this one's for you guys. Oh, and I also have 10 other packages, but they're all BTS related, so I want to save those for a separate video. Plus I have even more BTS stuff coming in the mail, so yeah, I thought it'd be fun if I just opened those like all together in one video. Uh, and then lastly, I just want to thank everyone who participated in my 10k giveaway. I already announced and contacted the winners earlier this week, so I'll be sending out their prizes soon. And yeah, enough blabbing, let's just get straight into this haul. I'm going to get started with the trades first and then work my way to the biggest package. Okay, so here are all the trades that I've done, and yeah, it's a lot. If you saw my last video, then you saw that I opened a lot of new albums, so there was a lot of trading to do, mostly for Stray Kids, I think, and got seven. But anyways, one of them is already open. Oh yeah, this is from Stray Kids' uh, Yellowwood album. So yeah, let me just get that open. So yeah, they're the unit photo cards. So yeah, let's just start off with this one. So cute. So I have like one set already because I did buy the album, but I only bought one copy. So yeah, I asked if anybody was willing to sell me these, and somebody did reach out to me on Twitter, so I'm really grateful. So, yes, thank you for these. I can't wait to add them to my binder. So, yep. And yeah, now let's get started with all my trades. I'm just going to start with this one and then work my way down the pile. So yeah, let me just move these out of the way for now. And yeah, let's get started with this one first. So, I traded with so many people, so I'm not really familiar with where each one is coming from, but... When I open it, I'll find out, of course. So let me get my scissors. Okay, so this is a cute card. It just says thank you. And yeah, let me get this washi tape off as well. This is Jackson from Spinning Top, so yeah, there's seven for each member, so I was just trading for like literally any car that I could, cross-trading between versions, so I completely forgot um, whose I traded her for, but yeah, let's just read the note real quick. So yeah, she just wrote, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope he gets to safe. Please let me know when you get him. Thank you so much. You inspired me to start collecting. Oh, that's so nice. I'm so happy that I was able to inspire you, and good luck with your collection as well. So yeah, there's her Twitter and Instagram, and yeah, let me just get Jackson out. Okay, so let's actually start off with the freebies. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Oh, this is adorable. I love that. <laughs> Oh my gosh, these are all Jungkook. I'm gonna cry. Yay, even when it's not a BTS haul, we can somehow manage to get BTS content. Oh my gosh, they're all Jungkook. I'm gonna cry. These are so beautiful. I'm definitely gonna start um, like a freebie binder because you guys send me the cutest things. I love this jacket there. Thank you so much for sending me my baby. Oh my gosh. And then, yes, Jackson, of course. Let's get him out. Okay, and there he is. I love this photo card so much. He looks so amazing. And there is the back. But yes, so happy to have traded for him because he's one of my favorites. And yeah, let's just keep going. But thank you so much. I love the freebies. And yeah, let me just put her note there too. Okay, so here's the next trade. And oh my gosh, look how dirty the envelope got when it was sent to me. I don't know if I need my scissors or maybe I can just tear it. You know what, let me just get my scissors, so one second. Oh, 
Oh, there's a note. So this just says, thank you so much for trading with me. Please let me know when Jackson arrives. And I believe that's her Twitter handle. And then in the back, oh, she used this as proof when she's sending me pictures of the photo card. So, yep, look how cute the bunny is, Stagel JK. And that was my Twitter handle at the time, although I did change my Twitter handle to Stagel JJK because, yeah, I don't know, I was getting sick of SG trades. So, if you see my community post, I uh, mentioned that as well. But anyways, enough shameless self-promo. Let's get this open. I feel so stupid because the person left me like video instructions on how to carefully open this so that I don't damage the photo card. And yeah, I completely forgot what they said and I'm too lazy to go back onto my Twitter right now. So we're just gonna try to open it and hope for the best. But yeah, I think I'm just gonna cut on the side or I'll figure it out, but <laughs> anyways. Okay, I got it out safely, so not the way she intended me to, but I still got it out. And it looks like she gave me freebies of Mark. Aw, no wonder she asked me who my bias was. Whenever people ask me my bias, I figure they're going to give me freebies. So yeah, this is from Hard Carry Era, and oh my gosh, this is when like I fell like head over heels for Mark because he was always my bias. But oh my gosh, this was the era that I got into Got Seven anyways, and this was such a look. And then from Eyes on You, so pretty. And then this really cute photo card of Jackson with the heart. So let me get that out. Okay. So yeah, I remember trading her for my young Jay. So really happy I got this photo card. This is so cute. I can't wait till I get um, all three of theirs with the hearts because I only collect Jackson, Mark, and Bam Bams for this. So, but for people who collect OT7, that would be so cute to have like a full page of them with the hearts. So yeah, let me move all that aside. All right, and on to the next one. Okay, so here's the next trade. And yeah, look at the back. How cute is that shiggy washi tape? I love it. And then yeah, it says Jason Yellowwood PC. So yeah, spoiler alert, that's who we traded for. But I don't know which version because I traded for a couple of Jason PCs. So we'll find out. Let me just get this open. Okay, and yeah, let me get this washi tape off too. Okay, so I wanted to save the washi tape, so I tried to open it as carefully as I could. And let's get this open. Okay, oh, this is so cute. Let's read her now. So, thank you for trading with me. I hope Jason gets to you safely. Please let me know when you've received him. Also, I love your videos. Aw, thank you. And yeah, let's get this out. Oh no, I dropped something. Oh, it's a little Jimin sticker. I love that. Oh no, this person sent me a lot of freebies too. The guilt I feel when I see this because I don't think I sent anything. I feel horrible. So this is a really cute Jungkook sticker. These are so nice. I'm getting a new BTS binder, so I'm going to decorate my new binder with these. I love these. Oh, got seven from Fly Era. And... Mark got seven. Oh, this is so cute. Look at Mark over there. Baby. Okay, and then... Hold on, there's more. She didn't stop there. This is so nice. Thank you so much. How do I open this? Aw, Mino. The bias wrecker. This is really nice. And then... Who is this? Oh, NCT. Jisung, so cute. And then, of course, this Jisung. <laughs> so yeah, Jisung's yellow border PC. Love it. And there's the back, the QR code. 
so thank you so much for all the freebies i love them so much oh my gosh i have so many bts freebies you guys like honestly know the way to my heart <laughs> so yeah let's keep going man these are just three of the trays and i already got so many nice things from you guys okay next trade and yeah again with the cute washi tape I really need to invest in washi tape. I keep saying that, but like I'm not a stationary person, but then whenever I do trades, then I'm like, oh yeah, I wish I had gotten some. So <laughs> anyways, let me get this open. Oh, this is such a cute card. Live, laugh, love. It's really cute. Aw, freebies. And I got Mingyu and June. Yes, the two biases that I will never shut up about because I love them to death. And yep, yeah. hi Sana, thanks again for trading with me. Hope June gets to you safely. Take care, Sunny. Yeah, we traded once before in the past. It was for their um, We Make You album, but this is for a happy ending. And I forget if this is the normal version photo card I traded for, but yeah, let me just get him out. There he is. So yeah, I forget which version this is. I'll insert it in the bottom when I'm editing this video, but I believe it says normal version photo card and he looks so cute. Uh, so far I haven't been able to find any trades for Mingyu, but it's okay. I'll see if I can collect or buy his photo cards, but they're gonna be so expensive. I'm crying. My wallet is crying, but it's okay. We're good. Okay, next trade. Let me get that open. This is such cute washi tape. Look how cute little pandas. Oh, there's a note. So, hi, I hope the June PC reaches you safely. Take care of him and thanks for trading. And there's the person's at. So, yep, here's another June trade. Okay, and there he is. I think this is the version C for the Blu-ray one, but again, not sure. I'll correct myself if that's not the case, but... There's the back. So yeah, got two out of four of June's photo cards, not including the uh, fan club edition because I don't collect those. Yeah, so happy to be making progress with June, but I really want to get some Mingyu too. Okay, here's the next one, and this came all the way from Norway. So yeah, I love doing international trades. Like sometimes I get worried if they'll actually like get delivered, but I, I mean, I just love sending things and receiving things from people all over the world. I think that's so cool. And then they wrote Felix Yellow Border. So we know what I traded for. So yeah, let me just get that open. Oh, by the way, this is the person's um, Instagram. So if you want to check that out. But yeah, let me get it open. Okay. Oh my gosh, they left such a nice note. Thank you so much for trading with me. I hope everything arrives safely. And then, again, that's their uh, handle. I think that's their Instagram handle, yeah. So definitely check them out. And wow, is this like a customized card? This is so cool. I love that. Look at the baby. So cute. Okay, and then let's take a look at the freebies. <gasps> Oh my gosh, Jungkook in his fake love outfit, Kill Me Now, and it's Cherry Clue too. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, no, not when Tae was crying. We're not even gonna look at that. Let's just, yeah, pretend we didn't see that. <gasps> He's such a baby. I love that picture. Yoongi, another disgruntled looking Yoongi, sleepy baby. Okay, and now on to Felix. I love this photo card. Let's get him out. Okay, there he is. And there's the back. Yeah, so I got two of their yellow border photo cards. I forget if I have Chan's already or if I'm trading for his. 
but really happy to be making progress for my yellow wood PCs. All right, so here's the next trade, and yeah, once again, don't remember where it's coming from, but let's just get that open. Oh, that's such a cute card. Oh, these are such cute stickers. Let's take a look at the stickers first. Oh my gosh, these are adorable. I low-key want to start journaling and stuff just so I can, like, use all of these. Like, maybe just a bullet journal if not even, like, a K-pop journal, but, like, honestly, I never keep up with that stuff. Okay, so let's just read her note. Thank you for trading with me. Please let me know when Jisung arrives. And then there's her, um, Insta handle. And then, I love your YouTube videos. Aw, thank you! <laughs> and she wrote, it's I-N. Yes, that looks just like him. <laughs> love that. Okay, so there he is. So yeah, this is the pre-order benefit card. And if you saw my last haul, you saw that I pulled three IN or Jungin. And because I don't collect him, they were all up for trade and I managed to trade one for Jisung. So really happy about that. Thank you so much again for the freebies and yeah, the Jisung trade. All right, so here's the next trade and it came all the way from Spain. So yeah, look how cute, again, the all washi tape and the stickers are, love it. <laughs> but yeah, let me get that open. Okay, so as you can see, I traded for one of Chan's photo cards. I think this is his photo shoot version, so let me get him out. he is. I love his hair, like blonde, and the headband. Such a look. And there's the back. So yeah, that was the trade. All right, and then she also left me a note, so let's take a look. Oh my gosh, freebies again. So let's take a look. Jungkook again. I love these so much, you guys. I can't even explain how much I love you all for sending me these. Like, it honestly makes my day. This one's so pretty from Persona. I love that. I loved this whole look, like pearl necklace and that sweater. I really gotta get myself that same sweater if I can find it. And then lastly, this one from Love Yourself Answer. I really loved this whole photo shoot too. So thank you so much for the freebie. Okay, and then lastly, let's just read her note. So she wrote, thank you so much for trading with me. I love your YouTube channel so much. Hope you keep with your videos. I enjoy them a lot. Hope little Chris arrives safe. Have a great day. And then, I know JK is your ultimate, so I wanted to include some Loma cards and clear cards. Oh, that was so nice of you. Yes, of course, he's my ultimate, and I appreciate every single thing that you sent me. Thank you so much. And yeah, let's move on. I still got a couple of more trades. Oh, let's see, three, four, five more trades. All right, so here's the next trade, and oh my gosh, you can tell that I hold these cards for a long time because the date on here says July 12th, and yeah, we're now in August, so <laughs> whoops, but yeah, let me just get this open. Okay, so that's a nice little thank you note. And, oh my gosh, yes, Jisung. So, hi, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope Jisung gets to you safely. Let me know when you get him. And, yeah, this was the pre-order benefit. So let me get him out. Okay, there it is. Oh my gosh, this is such a pretty card. I love the background, too, like the hot pink color against his black outfit. Look at him rocking those docks, too so good looking so yeah thank you so much for the trade so now i got both of jisung's pre-order stuff the card as well as the postcard okay so now moving on to the next trade so let me get that open okay so let's start off with the freebie first this is actually really great quality so this is of bang chan oh no wonder it is an official postcard I think this came with like the, what was it, pre-order sets for I Am Who. That's so nice. Thank you for actually using that. And then she wrote, thank you so much for trading with me. I hope Felix found a new home and that he arrives soon. 
and there is her at and yeah thank you and then the photo card is in here i'm assuming so let me get that open all right so there he is he's such a cutie oh my gosh look at his collar that thing is huge <laughs> and what's he holding hmm interesting all right and then here's the back so thank you so much for the trade i'm so so happy look at all these stray kids stuff that i have <laughs> so now let's move on to the next trade all right so here's the next one okay let's get that open oh this is mark's heart card so yeah let's take a look at the note first okay so hi sana thank you so much for trading with me i hope mark gets to you fast and safely please let me know when he arrives and then p.s best of luck with your collection also love your youtube channel oh thank you so much teresa that was so nice and let's take a look at the photo card Okay, so here's the photo card, and look how cute he is. He's pursing his lips, so adorable, in the back. So yeah, now I have both Mark and Jackson's little heart ones, so I'm just missing Bam Bams, but I'm really happy to have Mark's in. Fun fact, they were one of my first K-pop ships, and I love them so much. Still have such a weak spot for them, and yeah, let me just put the note with that. Okay. And let's keep going. I think I have three more. Okay, so here's the next trade. And I love the way people decorate the envelope so much. And this is official BTS washi tape from their 2019 season's greetings. So, oh my gosh, I appreciate it so much that you guys actually use this because I can never. Look how cute Jungle looks. <laughs> Jimin, Jim, so adorable. Love it. So anyways, let me get that open, and I want to reuse this washi tape. Let's see if I can save it. Okay, no, it won't, so yeah, I'm going to have to cut this unfortunately. Okay, so let's read the note first. Okay, so... Thank you so much for trading with me. I hope Bam Bam makes it to you safely. I really love your videos too, by the way. Kiara. And then at Stan Too Many Groups <laughs> on Twitter. Relatable. We're all about that multi-stan life. And now let me get this open. Oh my gosh, she sent me grape candy. That's so cute. She actually mentioned it to me. She was like, you're not allergic or anything, are you? And I was like... No, not that I'm aware of, so yeah, I'm definitely going to give this a shot. Look at this really cute freebie of Bam Bam. Not cute, I should say stunning. Look at him. He's so beautiful. Like, I still think of him as a baby, but man, has he matured. And, oh, she gave me this Jungkook, what is that, a post-it note? I know it came from the season's greetings as well. Yeah, it says it right there. <laughs> so cute. I haven't used any of my season's greetings things, so I wouldn't know. And yeah, let me just get this open. Alright, so first let's start off with the stickers. Focus. Okay. So yeah, cute flowers. And then also Totoro. How cute. I love Ghibli stuff so much. So thank you for that. And then Bam Bam's photo card that we traded for. I love this photo card so much. And he looks so good with purple hair back so yes thank you so much for the trade and all the freebies okay and finally the last trade so let me get that open oh my gosh this person packaged it so well and i already see freebies so oh bt21 okay so i got felix my son oh my gosh my number one baby boy. 
Yes. Oh my gosh. I'm living for these. Honestly, from this haul alone, I got so many freebies. I can't thank you guys enough. And let's read this note. Oh my gosh, you're such a long one. Hello, I hope Bang Chan made it safely. Please let me know when you receive him. I love your channel, so please continue your videos because I love them so much. I also gave you some freebies, mostly JK. <laughs> yes, I noted that. Thank you. I hope you love them all. Also, hope you have an amazing day and can't wait to see your photo card collection to blossom. Aw, thank you, Malika. That's so cute. Hashtag one of your biggest fans. Stop. Stop right there. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. Aw, and then the cookie sticker. Oh, you're so sweet. Honestly, I don't know what to say. I get all flustered and embarrassed when people say things like that, but honestly, it means a lot. So thank you so much. And oh my gosh, I I can't with you. This is too nice. I love the way you decorated that. Alright, so as you can see, I traded for Chan's pre-order card and postcard, and I traded her the IN set that I had. So yeah, let me remove the washi tape. I'm actually going to try to reuse this. Look how cute the tape is. Love it so much. Alright, so let's get this out. Okay, so... Let's we'll start off with the pre-order card. Like I said before, I just love this look so much. And Yellowwood is still one of my favorite comebacks. Still listening to it, still bumping to all the mixtapes. And I love their pre-order postcards. Like, look how pretty they are. So now I'm just missing Felix's set. Actually, let me just recap and let you guys know what I still have up for trade from my last haul. So give me a second while I get those cards. Okay, so for Stray Kids Yellowwood, I still have this Woojin uh, pre-order postcard as well as one of Jungin's uh, pre-order cards left up for trade and both of these will be up for trade for Felix because I'm only missing his from the members that I collect. And then these are actually up for sale. All of these from, um, I'll come back with this. Miro, <laughs> sorry. Yeah, so all of these will be up for sale. Um, I sold a few of these, but I still have all of these left. And then I have these two for happy ending still up for trade. I believe this is the B version and C version. So yeah, I'm not looking to cross trade. I want to keep it within the versions, but I'm looking for either Mingyu or June. And then I have one last Yugim left for Spinning Top, so he'll be up for trade for any Mark, Jackson, or Bam Bam that I don't already have. And the ones that I have are all the ones that I showed you in this haul. So yeah, just let me know if you are interested. And then lastly, I have these uh, pre-order cards from HMV Japan. So again, not a high priority, but I would appreciate if anybody would be willing to trade for Mingyu or June. So yeah, that's it for the trade portion of this haul. Once again, thank you to everybody who traded with me. I appreciate you all so much. Thank you for the kind letters and the freebies. Like seriously, it really made my day. And I make these videos for you guys, so I'm so glad that you enjoy them. But yeah, now let me clear this up so that we can move on to all the packages that I purchased. Okay, so now moving on to our first package. So this is from HMV Japan, and I only got it like a day or two ago, so I believe there are some new releases in here, which is exciting. So yeah, let's get that open. Okay, so as you can see, I got two copies of God 7's newest Japanese release, Love Loop, and I also got Monster X's Alligator. So Alligator came out in the beginning of June, I believe, and Love Loop just got released like a couple of days ago. So yeah, really excited. And it also came with two pre-order postcards. So again, it's probably going to be random members and super excited about that. But why don't we move that aside for now, because I'm going to start off with Monster X's Alligator it was released first and I'm just curious to see if this comes with a photo card or not because I know it only comes with first press 
And I'm not sure if this is going to be first press or not because, yeah, I got this kind of late. So, yeah, let me just get that open. Okay, so here's the OB strip. And, yeah, so the album itself. So I got the normal edition. For Monster X, I only collect their normal edition for Japanese albums. And then, as you can see, the tracks here are Alligator and Swish. I think I only listened to Swish like one time and not my favorite track. Alligator was fun, not my favorite Japanese track by them, but yeah, still good. Uh, I really love Juhani's uh, intro to his rap. I'm an alley alligator, that was so cute. But yeah, CD, do I even do this on my channel? Not really, but we'll just go ahead. Oh, upside down. See, this is why I don't do this. <laughs> and yeah, let's see. It's not going to be a photo book, really, but there might be a photo card. So, the boys. Wow, I love their outfits. Very aesthetic. Oh my gosh, yes, I got a photo card, and it's Kihyun. So, I don't collect anybody specifically Monstex, but I do keep my polls. So, that's fun, and if you're interested, I'll just show you what else it comes with. So, I think this is like for fan events, but yeah, I live all the way in the US, so I can never go, and I don't know what that is. And then just the lyrics to Alligator and Swish. Hmm, I think my favorite Monster X Japanese release though is Spotlight. Like, I don't think anything has topped that since, but Shootout was also good. Uh, let's see, I'm making a mess. Let's just put that back in there. Alright, so let me just move that aside for now. And yeah, let's move on to the postcards for Love Loop. Okay, so let me guess who I got and we'll see if I'm right. Okay, I think I'm gonna get a JB and Yo Gyung because I seem to pull those two a lot. Alright, so one, two, three. Oh my gosh, <laughs> Jin Young, but this is so pretty. My gosh, I love that. And let's see if I was right. Yes, I knew I was gonna get a JB or a Yogyam at least, and this is really pretty. So I don't know. I don't know if I'll be able to collect these because now that Jackson isn't participating in their um, Japanese releases, he's like one less member to collect. But if anybody wants to trade for a Bam Bam or Mark, that would be cool. Otherwise, I'll just keep these because I'm not too serious about their Japanese releases. Like, I just keep what I pull for the most part, but I'm always up for trades for my biases, if available. So, yeah, let me know if anybody's interested, but honestly, this concept is so pretty. I love it. All right, and now let's take a look at the albums. Okay, so for this album, I just got two versions. So, as you saw before, I just got the normal version, which has the group cover, and then I also got Type C, which has Mark's cover. And they did a total of eight versions this time, which I think is absolutely ridiculous. Like, I swear, these companies don't make it easy for us collectors. So, yeah, they did the normal version, then they did Type A, which was the album and DVD version, and then they did six more versions for the members. So, yeah, like Type B was JB, Type C was Mark, and so on and so forth. But, yeah, I'm just going to stick to collecting the normal versions for God 7 and... Um, in the case that they do member versions, I'm just going to stick to getting marks. For the previous release, I Won't Let You Go, they did unit versions, so I was lucky that they put Mark and Bam Bam together because they're my biases, so I just got that version. So yeah, I think two versions for GOT7 is doable for Japanese releases because they're high up enough on my um, bias list, I guess, for groups that I can justify getting more than one version. But anyways, let's get the normal version open first, and then we'll take a look at Type C. Okay, so yeah, let's get started with this version, which is the normal version. Okay, so OB strip. And yeah, let's take a look at the back. So I'm curious to see what songs they have. Okay, so this only comes with five tracks. I know there's more tracks, and I feel like... Maybe they put them on like different versions, which is so annoying, but I actually listened to the whole album and I know that there's like a total of eight tracks, so there's three bonus tracks. So out of these five though, I love Love Loop, which is the title track and the music video is so gorgeous. I really love this song. It's probably one of my favorite Japanese title tracks 
and just releases in general, like this whole album. And then what else do I like? I really like track number three. I don't know what that translates to. And then I really like Drunk. And then from the bonus tracks, hold on. I'm curious to see if the bonus track is on here. Uh, on this one, they just have the instrumental for Love Loop as a bonus track. So I don't know. There's actually three more songs though, because there's a song called Hashtag Summer Vibes, which I really like, and Superman, but I don't know which versions those are on because I didn't get all the versions. That sucks, but I also see it online. <laughs> so anyways, let me get this open. And by the way, look how gorgeous the cover is. I really love this concept. Oh wow, the CD is pretty too. Look at that. In the back. So nice. Like I said before in one of my videos, GOT7 have the best concepts ever. Like everything they do is just so pretty and aesthetic. Alright, so I just got an ad. Another ad type thing. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. I honestly want to kick myself for not being able to see them. Like this time around when they came to the US. Like they came to the Prudential Center, which I always go to see like all my K-pop groups, but I just didn't have it within my budget to see more than four groups, like within such a short span of time. So yeah, really sad that I missed out on that. By the way, they only have like two pictures, but that's Japanese releases for you. And no photo card. Darn, this sucks. I was hoping it would come with a photo card. Alright, so let's move that aside. Alright, so now let's take a look at Type C. Alright, OB strip, and yeah, the CD, and the back. Guys, I'm so obsessed with this, like this is just so pretty, look at the CD. And that, I just love the whole galaxy theme. And let's take a look at the photo book, it feels kind of thick, so I'm hoping there's a lot of pictures. Oh my gosh, he's so pretty. I can't. Guys. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like, he's so, so good looking. Oh, I'm the same group picture. Oh my gosh, this comes with a photo card. I'm so happy. Yay. All right, let's see who I got. And there's something in here too. All right, so let's just see who I got. One, two, three. I got the group picture. Wow, how lucky. I'm so happy that I got a group picture. That's really cool. And then let's see who I got in here. Oh, they're doing a Polaroid thing. And I got Mark's. Shut up. Oh my gosh. I didn't think I'd get his. I didn't get his last time. That's so cool. Oh my gosh. They did this last time too for the I Won't Let You Go album. So I'm so, so happy with that. That's exactly what I wanted group and my main bias. Perfect. All right. And then these are just some ads and the track list. And thanks to... It's always fun to see who writes the most. Young J. And then, oh, Bam Bam and Young Gyum too. Wish I could read that. All right. And that was it. But man, these pictures are so gorgeous. Like, I really like these two black and white pictures. So, yep. That was Got Seven's Love Loop. So that's cool. So I guess the normal version doesn't come with photo cards, so I would suggest getting one of the other versions. Okay, so I just rearranged everything to make space for our next package, which is right over here. And I wasn't sure at first what this was, but then I realized that it was a group order that I joined a while back, and so it's finally here and I'm really excited. It's an album that was really hard to find, so I had no other choice but to join a group order. So yeah, let me get it open. Okay, so here it is. It is Wavy's Takeoff album, and I'm so happy to finally have it. Unfortunately, it looks like it got dented on its arrival to me, so yeah, it looks pretty bad. And honestly, I'm not sure. I'm considering getting another copy. I mean, I just wanted to get my hands on one, and the group order really wasn't that expensive, so I said, why not? Let me get, like, 
some of the cards of my choice because um yeah as you can see it's unsealed so i was able to select the cards that i wanted so it's fine like i said i'm probably gonna buy a couple more copies because i do want to collect these photo cards but anyways i'm really excited to see who i got because although i was able to kind of select who i wanted i wasn't sure if i was guaranteed those members so let's see one two three okay so there's a little sticker that came probably on the plastic and it looks like i got a freebie so there it is really cute picture oh i got sha jun he's so cute actually i didn't specify like anybody except like 10 because like he's probably my bias in wavy but it's so hard to choose but he's a potential bias wrecker. I still don't know the new members too well, but yeah. And then I got Lucas. Well, he's my bias wrecker as well. <laughs> I have so many bias wreckers, but I love everybody in all of NCT. And yeah, so this is just a little note that she left. Hold on. Thank you for placing your order with me. Please share your feedback and tag me. All right, so there's her at and yeah, so, I mean, otherwise, everything came in good condition, but the album just got dented, unfortunately, but hold on. This is getting really blurry. All right, so let's do a quick flip through. But yeah, like I said before, oh, let's take a look at the back first, the track list. So yeah, I love Take Off so much. And then we have the Chinese versions of Regular and Comeback. And I love Comeback. I feel like that song is good in, like, any language. Doesn't matter, like... I love the Japanese version, and then they released it in Korean, and now in Chinese, and it's just so good. But my favorite track is probably Say It, and I also really love um, Let Me Love You, and Dream Launch is really good too, <laughs> and I thought the music video was really cute for that as well. But oh my gosh, Take Off is so good, and they were so amazing, and I constantly watch the performance version. But, you know, let's just take a quick look. I mean, this got to me pretty late. Everybody was getting their albums and I was like so jealous because I was like, oh my gosh, I want to own this. So last minute I quickly joined a group order. But I know there are some sellers selling it on eBay, but the photo cards are going for so expensive. But yeah, I still want to collect them. So there's only seven members and honestly, it's not a lot. And there's only one version per member for photo cards. So like honestly that's doable it's just like the price right now is kind of ridiculous so hey if anyone's selling these photo cards please hit me up because i would love to buy the whole set oh my gosh lucas looks amazing that whole biker look is just so fitting for him and win win my little baby and 10 he looks amazing in the music video and shajan is just coming for everybody like that one line of his where he's like, can I be honest? <laughs> I've watched that on loop so many times. But they're all so amazing. Henry and Yang Yang. Yeah, so. Oh, and Kun too. I'm so happy because I feel like last year, even though he technically debuted for like NCT 2018, like this was better for him. And he had more screen time and lines. So, yes. So those were my pulls and yeah, um, I don't mind that I didn't get a 10 even though like I specified for him because like I said, I want to collect them all still because I'm crazy like that. Oh, I'm sorry, it's not focused. But anyways, that was a takeoff album and yeah, let's move on to the next packet. Okay, so yeah, I just again rearranged everything. I'm going to have to constantly do that to make space for these next couple of packages because they're getting bigger and bigger. But yeah, the next one is from H&B Japan as it says over there. So really excited. I think I know what's in here. So yeah, let's just get it open. Okay, can you tell what it is? <laughs> so, looks like I got an NCT freebie. So this is from Wakey Wakey era. Oh my gosh, look at Johnny's hair. I can't get over that. <laughs> like why would they give him that wig? <laughs> but anyways, let's see what else. Oh, I got a poster. Let's see what it is. Oh my gosh. 
sorry i probably should zoom out a bit but i think you guys can see the full thing bts's lights this is so pretty i love that they give posters because i no normally don't ever select posters but yeah so pretty okay so as you guys have probably guessed i got the bts lights albums as well as some nct 127 so let me just get this out of the plastic and then we can take a look at it Okay, so first, why don't we get started with the BTS albums? So this is their latest Japanese release, Light Slash Boy With Love, and I really adore this comeback. The music video makes me so soft, I loved everything about it, and I'm so excited to have these albums, but unfortunately, I'm not going to open them in this haul because I ended up ordering the Universal box set, like the whole bundle set, including the postcards and the photo cards, as well as the fan club edition, off of an eBay seller for a really good price. So I'm probably going to sell these. Not probably, I am going to sell these. So I want to keep it brand new and sealed for whoever wants to buy it. So if you're interested, please let me know. Just hit me up on Twitter. So at S, um, sorry, I was going to say SG Trades. I'm so used to that. At Stay Gold JJK and yeah just dm me and but only for like um people in the u.s unfortunately i can't ship this out internationally because it'll just be too expensive and you guys are probably better off just buying it off of some other online retailer rather than me if you're international if you're in the u.s then the price will be the same so don't worry i won't charge a lot and shipping won't be expensive either because they're not big albums okay so next up why don't we take a look at nct 127's awaken album so yeah, this is an older release. This came out back in April, I think, which, wow, seems so long ago. But anyways, as you can see, I got the CD and Blu-ray version. And I always get the Blu-ray version for Japanese releases because uh, DVDs are region 2 and won't play for me. And although the Blu-ray won't have English subtitles, like, I just enjoy watching it. And usually it just comes with the music videos or making of, so yeah, I have no problem with watching that without subtitles. And yeah, as you can see, the CD has 12 tracks, so some previously released tracks, some new ones for the album. And from the new ones, I really like Lips, um, Blow My Mind, and End to Start. End to Start is probably one of my favorite NCT songs, so definitely give it a listen if you haven't already. I feel like it's one of those hidden gems. And I really did like Wakey Wakey as well, but it's not my favorite. I think I enjoyed Chain more than that, but... Yeah, I love NCT, and their Japanese songs are so good. And yeah, those are the Blu-ray contents. So yeah, approximately 129 minutes. So yeah, that'll be fun to watch. And the reason I got this so late was because I had already ordered um, all nine member versions when the album released. And because it only comes with like nine photo cards, I was happy with just getting nine member versions and then collecting the photo cards through those. So there was like no rush to get this. I knew it wasn't going to go out of stock. So I was like, I'll get it when I get it because Blu-rays are really expensive. And I already broke like my bank account by just ordering all nine member versions. I actually brought them out to show you guys real quick because I never did unbox these. So... Yeah, let me just show you. So we got Taeyong, Jaehyun, Yuta, and these covers are so gorgeous. Johnny, Taeyo, Jungwoo, Jelyong, Mark, and Chan. So yeah, not gonna unbox these, but just wanted to show you guys that I did have these albums from before. It's just I was holding off on getting the Blu-ray. But now that I finally got it, I'm really excited. And it should come with a photo card, maybe. I don't know since it's kind of old now if it would come with one, but we'll see. Okay, so there's the cover. I really like this design. And the back. So, how do you get this out? Okay, slide it out. Oh, that's such a nice picture. Yeah, I always like to get like a group version, even if I get like all members. Still want the group one, so. Uh, let's see. Actually, the photo card's gonna be in here if there is one, so why don't we take a look at this first? Oh my gosh, it does come with a photo card. So I got Mark. But because I completed the set already, um, if anybody's interested in buying this off of me, hit me up again on Twitter. So, yeah. So cute though. I love that. And the ads, nobody cares. And then the CDs. So, 
Yep, and that's that. And why don't I take a look at the photo book real quick? Look how beautiful they all look. Anyways, let's get this open. Like I said, since it's older, we can do a quick flip through. Oh my gosh, why is he choking himself? Like, choke me instead. But, oh my gosh, Taehyung with pink hair. He looks good with any hair color, let's be real. <laughs> Sorry, that was just really fast, but it won't really fit in frame, so, like, what's the point? But yeah, that was the Awaken album. Yeah, let me move that aside. And yeah, Mark will be up for sale. So now let's move on to the DVD, or Blu-ray, because I'm really excited to get into this. By the way, I just want to quickly apologize if half these clips are out of focus. Like, it's not until I, like, look back to see some of what I recorded that I realize that it was out of focus, because I'll bring something, like, close to the camera and then pull it back, and then everything else goes blurry, and I'm sorry, I'll try to be more aware of that. But anyways, let's take a look. So, this looks like it might be a pre-order gift, I'm not sure since it's not like inside the album. It may or may not be, so let's just take a look. It looks like it's a magnet. Oh my gosh, I opened that pretty poorly, but it's okay, it's just plastic. But here's the magnets and yeah, you could pop them out, which I'm not gonna do, but so pretty. I wouldn't know where to put it though. I don't have like any magnetic thing in my room, but yeah, I'll probably just put that in my binder possibly. It's too thick for that too. I don't know, I'll find a place for it. But here is the Blu-ray. Uh, let me make sure I got the Blu-ray. Yeah, this is the Blu-ray. <laughs> Two Blu-rays and a photo book. The DVDs comes with three discs, but as I mentioned before, it would be region 2, so I wouldn't be able to watch it. So here we go. So disc 1 contains all those songs. And this was their um, origin tour that they did in Japan. And I was so excited when like I was seeing fan cams on Twitter at the time when they were doing this earlier this year. And yeah, these are all the shows or cities that they played. And yeah, an amazing track list or set list, I should say. And what was it? Baby Don't Like It and Mad City are like my favorites. Even when they came to the US, they performed those songs and it was so much fun when they were like on the jungle gym and it seemed like Taehyung was like strip dancing. <laughs> it was so much fun. Uh, what else? Simon Says and Fire Truck, like the performances were so amazing to see in person. Like I can't tell you how many times I would watch the music video and think like this would be so great to see live and it really was. And then disc two, backstage documentary. Gosh, I hate SM for not ever putting English subtitles for their um, DVDs and Blu-rays, but whatever. I'll still enjoy the performances, so let me get that out. Okay, and this is just like the OB strip that comes with the albums. And here's the case. The box is so pretty. I love this red color. Let's just slide the book out. Alright, so I believe this comes with a photo card, and I don't know if it's in the photo book or in this, but we'll take a look at the photo book first. So there's the cover. And yeah, let's just do a flip through. Really excited to watch this, so. My gosh, the set was really nice too. And I love all their stage outfits. I think NCT has probably one of the best styles of any group. And they're such amazing performers. Oh my gosh, what's going on over there? <laughs> I so watch that fan cam. Ready to watch it again. Oh my gosh, Taeyong in a crop top. I believe this was for Wakey Wakey. Like, seriously, K word me right now. So 
so it's really nice. I'll go back and look at that again more thoroughly, but I'm really excited to see my photo card. And for these kind of things, like DVDs, photo books, if there's a photo card, I'm only planning on collecting Taeyang if possible. It might be hard to trade for him, but we'll see. Alright. Oh my gosh, I got more. My son. Apparently he loves me. Like, look at him. He's so cute. Yes, he's my adopted son. So, if anybody wants to trade for Taeyang, let me know. But, yeah. I'll see if I can buy him, but he might be really expensive, as always. So, and then there's the ad, and then the discs. So, yep. Okay, so now that I clearly made a huge mess, let me clear all of this up so that I can make space for my last few remaining packages. So I still have five boxes that are K-pop related, and then I have my three manga related packages. So I'm going to save all of that for part two of this haul, and I'm going to end part one here. So I hope you all enjoyed watching, and I hope you stay tuned for part two. Bye!